This here is the pre-refreshed Tesla Model X and I will be demonstrating the key fob functionalities of this Model X. Pressing the top twice will actually open up the driver's door as well as unlock the vehicle. Pressing it two more times, it will open up the passenger door. Pressing the Falcon wing buttons, which are the windows, pressing it twice will open up the Falcon wing door. Pressing it twice on the other side will open up the driver's side one. Pressing twice here at the back, it will open up the tailgate. Pressing once will stop it. Press twice again to lower it. Again, one press is just to stop it. Two press will put it rest the way up. The wind did end up closing the driver's side door partially. Pressing twice here at the front will actually open up the frunk. You have to go and open the rest yourself, which will give you quite a bit of storage space, as you can see. Now to close it, all you have to do is press once on top of the key fob. You do have to close the frunk manually, however. So you lower it, and one hand over here and the other here, you can push it down to clutch. Just like that. Holding the back of the key fob, it will actually open up the charge port, just like that. The only way you can close it is by, even one press doesn't, you just do it like that, or you wait for it to close itself. Having the key fob in my pocket, I can walk to the Model X. It just unlocked the vehicle. I can then push the button and it will open the door for me. Press the button again, it will close it. This also features walk away lock. So once I walk away from the vehicle, it will automatically lock the Model X itself. Having the key in my pocket, I can now walk towards the Model X and it should unlock and open the driver door for me without me doing anything. For some reason, it's not doing that. And the setting is on. This X does have the summon features. If I hold the top of the key fob for like three seconds, the lights turn on, so does the hazards. Pressing once on the top will cancel it. If the vehicle is unlocked, if you hold the top, it will actually turn on and fold the mirrors as well. When the hazard lights are on, press the front. And now it's actually gonna pull out. I'm not pressing anything on it. If I get in the front of it without touching anything, as you can see, it stopped. If I move back, it gave up right there. Let's do this again. I'm gonna try to go in front of it. And then usually it starts steering away like that. As you can see, I'm not doing anything. If I quickly jump in front of it, it still stopped. If I press the back, it will start reversing. Just like that. I'm gonna run to the back. Let's see if it will stop. Yep, okay. I can then press once and then it should stop just like that. Press the back again. And it stopped. Pretty smart. You can also press the door handle and it will cancel it. I hope I covered up everything on the Model X key fob. If you guys are new to the channel, consider subscribing. Let's just go for a little walk with the Model X.
see you guys next time